with Professor Stuff and uh, I am Sudhat Mishra and uh, I am back with my new video on Android development on Android. So in this video we are going to see that how can you make your Android app on AIDE which is available for Android on Play Store you can download it from there. So after installing you will see a page similar to this not exactly I think but similar to this. So here you can also learn programming okay uh, this app provides you offline courses okay for java android app game so uh, the last thing the web uh, development uh, is not available yeah, in this app you have to download the web version of this means i mean uh, there is another another version of aid for html and other web development so you have to download it from play store okay so Let's just not talk about that. Uh, in this video, we are going to learn Android app development. So let's just start. So uh, we will click on code for experts. So I am an expert, you are an expert. So let's start. Okay. Uh, now uh, you can see here uh, there is no project open. So we will start or make a new project. Okay. Create a new project. No, no. I want to create a new project. So I want to create a new Android app. Uh, give name to your app. I will just uh, set it to I'm professor. So I will set to professor. Okay, professor. Let's just name it T the professor stuff TPS. Okay, my app. My app. Let's just change it to me. And that will be calm. Uh, for uh, I'm just doing this so that I can show you that you can change it uh, your way. You can change it randomly. Okay. So let's just create the app. Okay. Yup. My app is created. So uh, uh, it gives you some basic code already. Uh, since it is an IDE, so it will give you a basic. What to say? A basic uh, app already made. So let's just run it and show you what it says. In this video, uh, I'm just gonna give an introduction to you uh, how this app works. So uh, remember, I I uh, I kept the name prof, prof, so it is showing prof at the installation time, and it didn't ask for any permission because we didn't demand it for such. Actually, we haven't started coding yet. Okay, so uh, the basic app prints hello world. Okay so let's just see what the code is so uh, this is an xml you can see here main.xml this and here this is java file so these both are interrelated we will see that later but uh, here you can see that the, this linear layout xml in is so this is basic syntax of xml uh, you need not uh, necessary to learn uh, means it is not necessary to learn XML before Android development uh, means yeah uh, basic basic XML is required but not that higher level okay so uh, you can also get help from this app uh, I showed you that uh, this app helps you in learning okay uh, it has available offline courses in it so uh, let's just see what this xml code says so uh, here uh, this is a linear layout and this is text view this one okay so android colon text equal to string hello world so what does this means okay this actually means well, let me show you string uh, at the rate string generally means uh, you are referring to a string variable and the variable where it is stored is in this res values strings here you see strings and here is hello world so this hello world is storing this hello world which we saw in our app when we just compiled it okay so now open xml main.xml and you can see a string at the rate string hello world so this is the variable name and this is the the name of the values xml file okay so uh, this is actually the string type uh, means uh, what type you are referring to at the rate strings so this hello world is a string if i changed it to anything just uh, such as id or uh, uh, int uh, etc etc then it will not accept that okay because hello world is a string 
now android layout width so what would the what will be the layout means width of the layout so uh, it will wrap content means uh, suppose this text view let me show you so uh, in uh, when you will install the app it will not be in the premium version so uh, it will not support this design view okay uh, you will just see the layout of the app and design view but you cannot do anything with the design view okay so here you see that this hello world is surrounded with some lines dotted lines okay uh, so what actually it is this this text view so it is just wrap content so it is the size of the text view is just uh, stick to the hello world okay now uh, let me show you uh, the main activity the java file so this uh, remember the package we gave com.tps.me so this package name is here import android.app this uh, imports the components of the library app android.app android.os library os then public class main activity extends activity so let me just show you this documentation no 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 i don't think it will be available here so Mm, this activity actually is another class and this main activity is uh, just uh, means taking some activities or what to say uh, just inheriting from this uh, activity okay uh, main activity is just inheriting from activity at the rate override then some basic code and in this protected void on create bundle etc etc blah 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 uh, you can see here that uh, super dot on create means when the app will run uh, it will set the content view means it will set the layout to r dot layout dot main which, which is this main dot xml file and whatever this xml file contains will be shown in this will be displayed in our app okay so let me just uh, change uh, let me just show you some extra amazing stuff you know uh, i can just simply right here my name professor and it will also display professor you need not to store uh, uh, in variable uh, in, in variable type uh, just like uh, it is in hello world so here it is showing professor okay and uh, one more thing to show that you can see the wrap content uh, it is professor it is just stick to the professor let me just change this to match parent width will change to match parent and will it will see let me show you so see what is just happened okay so this is some basic xml introduction and ide introduction for you so in this video i am not going to show you how in the design view what means uh, how will you use the design view to design your app okay design view is actually some shortcut for your android making okay so because uh, in the first you will download first when you will download this app from play store it will not be in the premium version but uh, you can check uh, the description and you will find a link for the premium version of the app and you can download it from there so that's it for today friends uh, uh, if you are new to my channel just click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the ring button and uh, uh, don't forget to give a thumbs up for this video if you liked and to yep that's it for today thank you